Okay, what's up? So on my way to work. Uh, packing some lunch. Thinking if I should quit my job. I don't deal in any way. But I just wanted more money to my, to get my goals faster and uh, to be more productive. And it's boring at home. Um, so yeah. So I came up with another solution today uh, because you know you might need the job, you might want the job, you might want the money, you might need the money. So why quit because of toxic people? There are solutions, you know. If, if, you're, if they're co-workers, you're with the same team, department. So said sadly, it's not easy to change teams, departments, or bosses. So maybe what you can do is just be a better person. <coughs> Uh, if, they, if it's some things that they don't like about you uh, or imperfections or some of your imperfections uh, work on it work on it day by day you know uh, find solutions to it improve it to improve yourself you know as a, as a better person as a better human being no, and just be nicer to them. Uh, <clears throat> uh, you don't need to ignore them. When they talk to you, you, you can't respond to them. But just distance yourself. So, yeah. Just make yourself less available so that you can recharge. You can contemplate and you can get some space, get some fresh air. Get your mind off the things. Off things and uh, get your mind off what they said and try to, I don't know, uh, yeah, just get some peace and quiet, peace of mind. To yeah, sometimes that's sometimes that's all we need, just some space, you know. Uh, <clears throat> you know, I take it as a challenge. Okay, so take it as a challenge. So, so stay there. You know, uh, you have your own goals, so it's a challenge just to be a better person. How to deal with <laughs> worst case scenarios when you've been through worse. So uh, this is not the worst. Might be the worst. So. You might experience worse in the future, so just if you can't leave yet, if you don't want to leave yet, you know. I mean, uh, what am I gonna do today? I uh, I'm gonna do everything the the things that I love to do, but uh, I would prefer to have more money <clears throat> than I'm earning right now, and having double jobs solves that. So it's not quitting right now. It's not the solution to the problem, you know. If you can't talk to your boss, if you can't talk to your boss, but if you can't, uh, maybe, you know, just prepare for the future. Prepare for your exit plans, you know, what to do next, or what you can do to afford, avoid the situation in the future. Or maybe just <coughs> in the future, avoid, just maybe the future, just avoid, avoid having a job in general in the future. But what you can do, what can you do to, uh, not have a job in the future, but still earn as much income as you want or need. So, double job, double jobs get me the income that I need, that I want. What if, uh, <coughs> what if you get double passive income? Double businesses, so. Use the job right now to get some money to raise funds for other business or side hustle to generate more side income or active income, whatever kind of income. So use that, okay? Use that as stepping. Use this current situation as a stepping stone. So there you have it. So uh, so when you still see them, you know, just be nice, be polite. Uh, go not overreact about it. <clears throat> well, you have the right, okay? But if you did overreact, because you have the right to your emotions, you can't control how they, uh, what they do say about you, but they also can control what they say, what you do or say about it. Uh, but you cannot. Not, you can just not add any more to the problem. Just make, uh, you know, just think, you know, your life is great. You're not perfect, but your life is great, you're independent, 
you make more money than them, twice as money than them. Uh, also, keeping your money, you know, you have the FPU money. I have the FPU money. I can leave any time that I want. So, I'm not in the mercy of that stupid company or stupid boss or stupid toxic co worker. So, I can uh, live without that, you know. This is just that I upgraded my lifestyle. <clears throat> more than, uh, I can afford it, but more than it suits the the pace of life that I want. But I, but I also want a job, you know, because I've uh, been three years retired, it's boring at home, so. And I wanted more income. I, wanted, I just wanted to be more productive. But, yeah, just think of your exit plans, your other, your plan B's and your C's. So, don't listen to those influencers that say, no, risk everything. Don't have a plan B. Don't have a plan C. It's not the way to go. Things can fail. You can still give it 100, your 100%. Or not. Even though you have other plans. You know, if you have plans, that's why we get insurance plans, medical plans, uh, burial plans. They're not, we're not paying for those for nothing. So the influencers are just uh, lying, I guess. You need, you need plans. That's why you can't be a YouTuber like me if you don't have plans, you know. I have lots of plans and safety nets. I plan like 5 to 10 years ahead. So plan ahead. So what you can do to avoid this situation is to solve this situation to make your life, make your life better. Okay, so I just remembered one of the reasons why I got back to a job because Taekwondo is very expensive and I want to have more savings at the end of the month and uh, <clears throat> money to spend on Taekwondo and Taekwondo equipment. Taekwondo membership is so goddamn expensive. The gears, belt promotion is so expensive. <laughs> That's why I also want to say got the job. And uh, yeah, I want to buy like uh, Taekwondo floor mats here, gym mats. Martial arts mats here, so it's gonna take a lot of money. I have the money, but uh, but I have like a, I want to have as much uh, savings as I can, you know. Uh, if I'm not getting like like as much savings as I prefer every month, so I gotta take action how to make more money so that to cover that. <laughs> uh, Expenses so that I will still have the same amount of uh, savings because I have plans long term. So maybe just uh, dial down your plans, your other plans, because you know you need the job. Uh, you need a job for those big plans. So maybe just <clears throat> reboot your plans. You know, maybe yes, I can still push through with my plans. I mean, if I quit that job, I will have other options. It will be like. Uh, uh, not what I first preferred, but it's a backup plan, so it's an option to fall back to, so at least I can still live a peaceful life.